Next stage, a man looking for trouble. What can you see beyond the darkness? Hello, we are here. If I press the right buttons, yes, I have. There's some music. Hi, Peter. Hello, how's it going? Yeah, good. I'm ready. I'm ready for this. The final live reaction stream from us mm -hmm. at E3 2021. Do you want to tell the people the slight tweak we've done on the predictions to try and guarantee a winner today? Yeah, so uh, Ben and I have predicted the same sort of basic likely prediction which is that breath of the wild 2 will appear in some form um so because it's draw a, a draw at the moment everything comes down to the unlikely predictions and by their nature neither of them might happen and therefore will be on a draw to the end so we've both got an extra likely ish prediction uh, in addition to the breath of the wild um so mine is that we will see yeah. a new donkey kong game hello boys and walrus clan hope you're all well just checking in while at work to say hello. The E3 content has been amazing. Big love to you all. Stephen, thank you very much. Thank indeed. you, Stephen. Uh, and Ben, your prediction is, remind me, I've already forgotten. My prediction is that we will see Metroid Prime 4. Oh, yes. <laughs> 4. So those are our new predictions, as well as the fact that we both predicted we'll see Breath of the Wild 2 today. Your out there prediction, Crash in Smash. Yes, My that's out right. there prediction, the Switch Pro releases this year, which is looking pretty unlikely. Not that it, it won't release this year. That is that is unlikely, though. Uh, but that Nintendo tweeted out that this will be software only. Mm. So there we are. Yes, we are aware of Nintendo's tweet about co-streaming. We're not really streaming it, so we think we're okay. We're just going to try it. Uh, we're not rebroadcasting it, you know, with, with a significant amount of sound or the whole screen. So we hope that we can squeak by, but we will see. We it will may see. at least not get recognized by recognition software, Hope, if nothing hoping, else. But, hoping that. Yeah. If we run into issues and disappear, you know why. Uh, mm, and then we'll just yeah. go live again, but without it. So, What's the worst mm -hmm. that could happen? Exactly. We all lose our livelihoods. Let's go. Hi, boys. Amazing job on the 3S. Let's go, Nintendo. In the words of the living legend, my body is ready. Ready, Lazarus. Thank you very much. Um, we won't be seeing the living legend. He doesn't. He doesn't work do there anymore. anymore. He doesn't go here Nintendo anymore. Nintendo is the one I'm looking forward to most. Prediction: Plumber who doesn't wear ties for Smash. Hmm. Mm. Oh. Yeah. Montague Wang, thank you for the donation. Very much we indeed. are. Montague it's Wang. happening. Mild sound. Can I turn on those subtitles, please? Yes, I can. There they are. That's pretty loud for me. I'm just turning that down a bit. Jeez. Oh, it's so Nintendo already. Hashtag show the screen. You want to see the screen? We can show the screen. Full screen. There's a full screen. Thank you, Molly. And many people around the world are playing games on it. Nintendo Switch is being enjoyed by a wide range of players. Yeah, and I will be a guide as well. <laughs> it's fine. We need two guides sometimes. Yeah. I might turn it down just a tiny bit. Hopefully this doesn't turn into that. You remember when 
Um, that guy famously restreams the UFC pay-per-view, but he, he was holding a controller, so he was pretending he was playing the game instead. Oh, yeah, yeah. We might have to do that. You know, Nintendo's famous E3 game. Oh, two clicks. It's not actual gameplay footage, though, pieces. So oh, wow, you're a, you're a bit ahead of me there. Oh, am I? I, I had no idea why you said two clicks there. And Oh, boy. Something's happening. Do a quick pause when something happens, and I'll let you know when it happens on yeah, my Yeah, do you end. want to try and refresh as well? Because it, it will, yeah, well, will probably yeah, bring, you, bring you close to yeah. me for people who've already synced up. Oh, Look who it is! Well, it ain't Crash. <laughs> oh, it's Kazuya. I think he just threw Ganon into a volcano. He did. Does he oh, do that's that? Cool. Does he do that in Tekken? Yeah, they throw each other off cliffs and into volcanoes. They do that's that a lot, do. do they? It's Tekken yeah, versus Street Fighter. Do. There, it's happening. I mean, they've already done it, but it's happening in Smash now. Mm. That's fun. Oh, that was clever. The punch they were doing there, that's from the Tekken logo, the Bandai Namco you're, Tekken logo. You're way behind me then, if that's just happened. Someone else just got thrown off a cliff. There he go. <laughs> Everyone! Everyone's going off the cliff! Oh, that's I am about fun. to see the cliff throw. He's on the cliff. There he goes. Right, Captain I'm going to pause it when we see a title okay. of some kind. I'll let you know when I've done it. Oh, he's Devil as well. That's cool. It's an interesting choice of character. Yeah. Can't say I expected Tekken, though. Oh, is he... He's just in the background, it looks. I was going to say, you got you got Hair Man as well there. He's just watching. Hair Man's just watching. Yeah, they do that sometimes. They just show, like related characters. Okay, the full logo's just come on screen and the line's gone under it. Let me know okay. when the line goes uh, under yours. Okay. Logo... Line. Okay. Sorry, everyone. We have paused it. Hopefully you can resync. Smash Bros. No, X like Tekken. Oh, no, not Kirby. Oh, Kerbs. Don't do that. Uh... Oh, bud. He's checking. What happens if Kirby swallows the... There he goes. Swallows the lava. <laughs> Did they say they were only showing one character today for Smash, or do we not know? I'm not sure, personally. Mm. It's Sakurai! Surprise! Surprise! God, the scars on the art in the background are really... They look very deep. They're big, aren't they? Like his arm oh, was barely on in the free end. Free music playing now. That's cool. We're gonna get a copyright struck for that, or by Nintendo. Yeah. Which first? <laughs> punch, punch. So this is that thing they do at directs where they show every seemingly permutation of a new character's move set. Yeah. Which I personally don't think is really that interesting and in some ways sort of ruins the character reveal. I mean, I might be yeah. wrong. I'm not a Smash player, but the fact that I I can now see everything this character can do. Sure. It's, it would be Maybe some more of it should be kept to kind of a secret. Get to grips with it and, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. It, it's, it's probably just me, though. But I think they also know that you know, there are dedicated Smash channels that will look at every single That's one true. of these moves and go, oh, this is good because, uh, you know, it's going to allow you to Ten hit follow combo. through into an uppercut or whatever. No, Absolutely. Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Move set I'll never be able to perfect. <laughs> Just like real Tekken. There we go. More information. On whatever 628 is. The 28th of June. There it is. Thank Strange you. American yeah. dates, what you like. New fighter Kazuya will join the fight in Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Man. Please look forward to seeing how Kazuya, who has experienced many Big headbutt. battles across the Tekken series, will fight in this game. All right. Let's continue with our first batch of Nintendo Switch headlines. Click. 
graphics not synced with Your is with him. <gasps> its life is strange. I think there's a lighthouse. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this will be the remaster, maybe. Unless it's just a lighthouse. No, its life is strange. I've not seen this before, though. This is nice. It's art style, animation, yeah. yeah. It's the new character. Yeah, the the empath. They can all be sad together. Uh, we can all be sad with them. Oh, there you go. Yeah, both, both coming to Switch. Mhm. Mm Presumably. They're good games. Wonderful. Good games. I mean, the new one looks good, but the other ones are good. We know that. Life is strange. It, isn't it weird, though? It do be like that. It do be strange like that sometimes. On Nintendo Switch September 10th. And Life is Strange Remastered Collection comes to Nintendo Switch later this year. There's something for everyone on the Nintendo Switch system. This one, too. Coming to Switch. Coming to Switch. It does look good though, I would like that. The Ultimate Edition doesn't seem to include a Life is Strange 2 remaster, or am I wrong? No, you're right. I didn't see it in there. Um, was Life is Strange 2 developed by the same people? I can't remember. I don't know. It's strange that it's not there though. It's strange. <laughs> Life is strange. It is pretty. Yeah. Worms. worms. There are pills for that. It's no longer turn based. Worm based. Look at that hat. It's a nice hat. The performance on this is, I mean, I don't know if it's just the stream, but it looks very, very juddery. It's, it's a bit choppy, isn't it, this video in places? There goes the sheep. Was one of them just hairdresser? Did I, <laughs> Did I misread that? Did it say Not hairdresser? Sure. I don't know. Hairdresser. Hairdresser. Magician. Warrior. Hairdresser. Two Point oh, Campus. All these games that we've seen, they're coming to Switch. It'll make it easy for our roundup afterwards, won't it? Yeah, say, seen that. We've done that, that one. Covered that Switch. one. No, it's not too late to ask questions for the E3 podcast. We'll be recording it on Thursday. There'll also be a poll and another post going out tonight on the Patreon asking for your thoughts on your favourite game of the show and also which conference you thought was the best. Those will be going live at 11pm, hopefully after Bandai Namco tonight, so keep an eye out. Oh, bananas. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you, yeah, hopes got up there. They did. I th it's like when they did the the Banjo Kazooie reveal, and it was Duck Hunt, but it wasn't. It was actually Banjo Kazooie yeah. in uh, what was it in Smash? It's the other banana simian based game. There they go. I'm really, I really don't want to get too far into it right now because this is a Nintendo reaction. But I'm interested in your thoughts as a fellow big fan of Spider-Man. Do you not think it's hypocritical at all to be annoyed at Bethesda when Sony decided like three years ago to gatekeep Spider-Man? Well, the difference is that Spider-Man, yeah. Marvel's Spider-Man, as in the game series that Sony publish, uh, was never on other platforms. Spider-Man the character was, but that series wasn't. Whereas Bethesda franchises have been on other platforms and now they're gone potentially and i think that there is a disparity there for sure i don't think it's hypocritical it's like i don't, I don't have any issue really at all with starfield for example now being an exclusive apart mm. from the fact that it almost certainly was going to be available on sony consoles and now <laughs> yeah. isn't but that's it's fine it's what happens isn't it yeah it, but it's the fact that sequels to franchises that already exist are now going to be locked behind a, a different console that yeah. That feels a bit strange. But we can you know, talk yeah, about I've, it on a podcast at some point, we can. I'm sure. Um, but, you know, I'd feel exactly the same way if 
in a, an impossible world, uh, Sony bought the Halo franchise, and they said, <laughs> right, all Halo games now are only on PlayStation. You know, it's that's that's kind of. Thing. I know it's an extreme example, but that's the uh, that's the frustrating aspect to it. So is this new Mario Party, or is this? I'm, I'm not sure. I don't know the difference between them. They they all look the same to me. Oh, stickers. Yes. Okay, new Mario Party. Oh, new one. Hmm. It's previous boards from previous Mario Parties. There we are. Hmm. What did you think? Before we show this next trailer, I'd like to say one thing. Currently, we're working hard on the latest game in the Metroid Prime oh. series, Metroid Prime 4. Oh. Which we previously announced. Okay. But today... We'd like to introduce another new entry no. in the Metroid franchise. <laughs> not, we're not going to show that one, though. Man. We'd just like to say that we know there's a prediction out there at Triple Jump that we're going to show Metroid Prime. And I mean, we it's, acknowledge that. And it's that's more it. Metroid, though. So that, Metroid 5? Are you. Excuse me. Wait, what? <laughs> Did you just get one done? What on earth? Hey, it's more Metroid, though, so that's something. Hmm. Oh, they were so close to showing some Metroid Prime 4. If you just said new Metroid oh. game. <laughs> Metroid 5. My, my audio is out of sync. Is it? Yeah, when they fire guns and stuff. Like when he was doing... Clicking for the switch logo. Here we the, go. The this click wasn't. This looks like Metroid, thumbs. doesn't it? Ooh. Yeah. Oh my god. Jeez. Metroid. Bit intense. Dread. Dread. Good lord. What on earth? Sure does look it, like a Metroid, though. It does. Yeah. They might show Metroid 4 after this. They might have just been saying, you know, before we get to that. I don't know. Let's look at Metroid I don't, I don't have much hope. <laughs> no. Tell us about Dread then, chat. People seem to know what Metroid Dread is. Yeah. What is the matter with Nintendo? <laughs> I guess I'm demons. Thank you hey, for the super chat. They're just doing Nintendo stuff in their yeah. lane, moisturized, flourishing. They can do what they want. I mean, it's maddening and quite confusing, but they can do whatever they want. Yeah, whatever they like. Yeah. It's all up to them. Nintendo Treehouse, 10 8 21. Oh, well, that's coming out in like. It's coming out in so August. It's not, Metroid, it's, not. it's coming right. out in October. Um, that was the trailer. That's soon, though. No, that's, that's coming out in August. Oh yeah, it's ten eight. Yeah, you're right. Coming out in October. Dread was on the DS. Oh, okay. Okay. As the name Dread implies, right. this is a Metroid game with a new feel, showcasing a variety of threats that Samus will encounter. It's scheduled to be released on October eighth, so it won't be too. Ah, it's really soon, isn't it? So they just put Metroid 5 to troll everyone, right? Like, that wasn't Metroid... It wasn't Metroid Prime 5. It's... No. No, that's a different series, I think. Yeah. Um, hey, there's an amiibo, though. Bling! Ah, oh, here we are. Oh, yeah. There it is. A lot of uh, just retreading games we've already seen so far E3 game of the show this one I think I'm amazed at the longevity of these series I never know what the yeah. sales figures is but clearly they're not they're doing well enough aren't they Wow. Looks fun. It does actually. Oh, you can be a unicorn. <laughs> be a flying unicorn. 
Whoa, there's Whoa, dinosaurs. Dino land. Donut, UFO. That looks fun. Arcadey driving. I've been waiting for the ultimate Dragon Ball Z experience. I've had a fair few, you know, average Dragon Ball Z experiences, but the ultimate one is what we've been keeping our fingers crossed for. Yeah. Just dance those ninety percent of sales to church youth groups. <laughs> Majin Buu, of course. There's Majin, Majin Buu. Dragons. Along with the main story, you can explore the vast world of Dragon Ball. I've never watched Dragon Ball Z. I've never played a Dragon Ball Z game. I have no idea. What I think they're all about. called Goku. They're all called Goku. If that's all. There's I know. like six Gokus in this game. They all look the same uh, in the show. They have the same hair. There's like a grown-up Meowth. Uh, one of them looks a bit like Mewtwo. Uh, mm -hmm. Being facetious, of course, I know Dragon Ball Z is extremely popular. Yeah. <laughs> Mario Golf. Golf! It's time! <sighs> Love an arcadey golf game. Yeah. That's so nice. Dun, dun, dun. Nice shot. Oh. God, really cutting it close there, Mario. Mario is literally an unobtainable standard for like most aspects of life. He's too yeah. good at everything. Like he's he, he, he can just do everything. He's a polymath. He's too talented. Oh, look at that crowd. So this is where you like, run around between shots and hit each other oh more golf golf adventure this is like the rpg sort of mode i think look at this there's a flipping a flipping me thing a flipping oh, moltres in donk city look bouncing off the walls yeah donkin sorry new donk, Put a donk city. on it sorry i'm so sorry so set your tea time and get ready to ace those shots in mario golf super rush swinging onto the nintendo switch system swinging onto the nintendo switch system God, that soon. He's not a great plumber, though. Man never even has his tools with him. Ben. Oh, um. It's Monster Hunter Stories 2 again. This is the third time we've seen this now. Yeah, he's not that good a plumber, is he? It's about the only thing he can't seem to do very well. Yeah. That one, the orange one with the blue stripes, looks like a Digimon. Very Digimon, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Digimon are the champions. Champions. Change into digital monsters. Oh, there's a Lapras there. Oh, cow. Tail. Get you. Body. Double attack. The fact they call them monsties makes me really uncomfortable. Yeah. The lady last night at the Capcom showcase was really enthusiastically saying, So there are like 12 different kinds of monsties you can get? Oh, what are you doing? Why are you calling them monsties? Gammon. Gammon. That that one was called Gammon. Is there a Karen available? <laughs> a monsty of an adventure. Monsty Hunter stories. Too. <laughs> yeah. Why is it called Monster Hunter? Oh dear. I like that. I like when demos let you carry over your save. Yeah. Here's a new game from the head of a certain Is that Wario? <laughs> Sounds like it. Did you miss me? It's a me, Wario. Wario. It's a finally ready, a brand new game from my company. Check it out. You oh hell yeah. It's another mini game game. Wario where? Peel! Yeah. These are so, so brilliantly odd. Yeah. There used to be a Flash game called Four Second Fury that I played a lot of when I was a teenager. Oh, yeah. Um, it was games like this. You had four seconds to do each thing. It'd be like really quick fire. It'd be like, hit the apples. And you'd be hit the apples. And I'd be like, swap the flies. Yeah. And, you know, 
Super okay. fun, just high paced stuff. Looks delightful. Yeah. Ah, oh, he's always picking his nose. Why is it, why is he always picking his nose though? Oh, the tongue! Oh my god, the facial reactions. Oh, don't shake the baby. Don't shake the baby. Fantastic. Get it together. Game. Get it together. Love it. So many games Looks coming good. this year. Get it together. In the latest installment of this you should squeeze the toothpaste from the bottom, everybody. Mm -hmm. control Wario and his friends. There is also a two oh, I need to get toothpaste, actually. Need to make a note yeah. before I forget. Yeah, I'm running out. It's mm -hmm. in the near future, so Thanks, Wario. Next, please take a look at this. I will. It's why I'm here. We all will. Student living in Tokyo, your life is fairly normal. It's going to be Shin Megami Tensei. Yeah, it looks a bit that. It's not Persona. After you get pulled into a different dimension. Oh no! I hate it when that happens. And everyone's made of ding dongs, and it's really weird. I have to fight them. Mm -hmm. Just don't go to school in Tokyo. That's the answer. Yeah. Always having to right. fight monsters and stuff. A post apocalyptic world where angels Oh my god, those aren't angels, flipping heck. Another Tokyo. Suddenly you fuse with a mysterious figure, gaining the power to fight demons. What lies ahead in this alternate Demon person. Shimmy Gummy Tensi five. Whoa, there it is. There are the blobs. A lot of these demon designs will be very recognizable to Persona fans. Weakness. It's super effective. Oh, there's a cat. Yes. Cat in a hat. Cat she. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. I read it as it Kate is, yeah. forever. I'm like, no, that's not it. Stupid. It's Irish, I think. It's Cat she. It's not pronounced Sith, but it looks like Sith. Yeah, it's she. It might be Scottish. If the negotiation is successful, yes, I am satisfied. Will become a powerful ally. A monstie. <laughs> so I don't want any more monsties. <laughs> Has that got the body of a roast chicken? I think it has, yeah, in the head of like a... An onion. Uh, yeah, like a, a spring onion or something. Just a regular Locked. onion. Level up. Ooh. It's Tyrant Beelzebub. I want that on my side. Zap! That's cool. Can you like fuse any two together and it makes a hybrid? Yeah, that's usually how it works in um, Persona games, anyway. Although it's not necessarily a hybrid; it's just a new one. All right. Have different. You can look up the recipes online, find out what you need to combine to get certain things. I'll be watching this one with interest. I d the only experience I've had with Shin Megami, uh, Megami Tensei, sorry, was um, uh, the recent remaster that released, and I really wasn't that hot on it. Um, right. As a Persona fan, might be uh, might be worth playing. Yeah. This is the newest game in the series. Please look forward to future updates. Let's see a few more Nintendo Switch headlines. Click. Celebrate ten years of Danganronpa. Mm-hmm. Here's the bear. I would have spelled Mike M I C there, but you know, to each his own. Microphone. Mick, yeah. Decadence. Three games in the deadly Duncan Rampa series are coming to Nintendo Switch. I am this cool. Monarch 
Akuma, the self-proclaimed school headmaster, has trapped you and other high school students in a game. Other high school students. Yeah, I was <laughs> going to say they are not high <laughs> just, school students. Just pans past Hulk Hogan on the end there. Yeah. And so it begins. Kaya. Now you must condemn which of your schoolmates will die. Which of these other high school students will die? Oh, it's so... Flip. It's so Japanese. And hats off to him. Yeah, it is. I've tried Danganronpa. I think it was Trigger Happy Havoc uh, after I finished Persona 4 Golden because... This, this, the sort of same crowds that were making noises about P4G were talking about Danganronpa and I didn't like it, I didn't like it but I know that it has a very active and excitable fan base so I'm happy for you I hope they're excited now we're running out of time for Donkey Kong so it might literally just be one more thing, Breath of the Wild, and then we're all tied up, and that's it. Oh, God. One of us needs to get a point. Just a yeah. point. Come on. If only they'd either shown a bit of Metroid oh, Prime no. 4. Oh. The ghost hands. Or if flipping Netflix hadn't decided to do their own show this year, then that would have broken the tie one way or the other. It would have done. Is this Fatal Frame? Looks like it. Yeah, it looks it. like oh, it. Oh, it is. Yeah. Oh, God. Spooky photos. Spooky photos, no. The ghost hands are a bit much for me, to be honest. Yeah, there's are actual ghost hands there. New costumes and photo modes are included in this version. Can you investigate Mount Hikami? Uh, no. The kind of game that we ought to play together on, on joint stream, stream on yeah. Thursday, but whether we ever will, I whether really don't Whether we're brave know. enough to do it. Some even, today. Some even today? It's Doom! Doom Eternal. Doom Eternal. There's only one way to fairly inadequately break the deadlock, lads. Car park knife fight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That works, yeah. I guess there's still time for um, Donkey Kong. I guess we're not likely to see um, Metroid Prime. At we're not going to see Metroid, no. They could surprise us at the end. I know they've said software, but they might be spinning as a yarn. At the very end, they might say, coming soon. This year has to be the, the Switch Plus. Yeah. Uh, Switch Pro. Is, is, I thought 1 and 2 was already on the Switch. Clearly I was wrong. Uh, yeah, I, I would have assumed it was, but I, I guess not. Yeah, there you go. Really enjoyed that game. I've been thinking about playing a bit more of it, actually. I enjoyed yeah. it when it first came out and then, you know, put it aside in favour of other things, but... Oh, not the Witch Queen. I hate it when that happens. Oh, Strange Brigade. I've seen this. I've not played it, but I remember seeing it at several um, EGXs, I think. Right. Today! Wow! Right now! Mm-hmm. Here they are. It is. Here they are. Beep, 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 beep. Rabbits, once again to restore order to the galaxy. Our heroes must stop a mysterious We've got about nine minutes left. They said it was going to be 40 minutes long, this thing. I'm not hopeful, Peter. No. I feel like we're going to need to come up with some sort of solution. We might just have to both change our name. I feel like one of us, a, one of us needs to have our name, though. I think that's the... The channel just loses both hosts. Yeah. For a month. Yeah. So aim for victory with a little help from your friends. Wait, who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Well, one thing's certain. This is going to be one heck of a galactic adventure. Crazy. Mario plus rabbits. 
What what a flipping world, Peter. What? In what way? Just this game. Like, I'm so happy well, yeah. for the people who are excited for it. Mm -hmm. The Orange Star Nation? Oh no. Who will save it? Oh, what is this? This is... Oh, oh god. What's... My brain's gone blank. Uh, yeah, Advance Wars. <laughs> it just says it right there. It's Advance Wars! I like the art style. That's nice. Mm -hmm. They look like little um, sort of stop motion toys. Mm. Like something from CBeebies. <laughs> yes, but you know, war. Not war. <laughs> but war. Memorable characters and vibrant gameplay are in store as you lead the commanding officers. That is a very nice style of presentation. I do like that. Yeah, I like the look of this. I might get this. Reboot camp. Whoa. That's clever. That's a clever one. Like that it name. is. It's clever. Rather than Darksiders War Mastered Edition, which is just right. that's a bad one. This next segment will be our last announcement of the day. Okay. Please take a look. This this next thing is the last one. Is that what you said? Yep. Oh no. Well, oh okay right. Oh no mm, mm, no no no. It's just no it's okay. Just okay. DLC. What what the hell do we do? We'll react to this. What do we do? Uh, do we need to make a prediction for Bandai Namco at 10 p.m. tonight? Oh, jeez. We could do, yeah. It's Hyrule Warriors. This is a Musou, it right? Is. I think a Musou game. Uh, I don't know. Well, again, looks a bit choppy for me. Again, could be could be just the stream, as in. I like think Nintendo my sound's out of sync as well, company. actually. You know. Who is it? Flip a coin. Peggle 2, winner takes all. Like, we actually have a game of Peggle 2. <laughs> God. Hello there. I'm Eiji Aonuma, producer of the Legend of Zelda series. What you've just seen is a trailer for the first wave of DLC for the Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity expansion pass from Koei Tecmo Games. It will follow Link and his allies through more battles that took place 100 years prior to the events of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. I hope you'll look forward to it. I have a few more things to share with you all today. Oh. We'll begin with the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD game. Okay. Uh, so he might be about to finish on um, Breath of the Wild, but not that it's going to make a difference to the scores. Yeah, it'll make a lot of people very happy, obviously, but to our predictions yeah. contest, it doesn't really make much of a difference. I was going to say, it seems like a strange thing to end on, but I guess this is an entire Zelda package here for the next yeah. five minutes of various things. Um... A woman named Zelda. Well, but the boy's named Zelda, isn't he? <laughs> She's Princess Link. The little green boy. There it is, the Switch Pro. <laughs> it's the Switch Pro. <laughs> the Switch Pro. Oh, that's adorable. Into your pocket. That's really nice. Look at that. Coming today. While we don't have any campaigns or other Nintendo Switch games planned, we've been working on this Game & Watch system as a special item to help... Oh, that is lovely. Those will sell out immediately. Mm. Oh, Game & Watch. First game in the series, The Legend of Zelda. Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link. And the Game Boy version of The Legend of Zelda, Link's Awakening game. As well as a special version of the game and ah yes, <laughs> the true Zelda. <laughs> that looks lovely. That looks really nice. Yeah, nice idea. In addition, regarding the watch functionality for the game and watch system, we've added a playable clock based 
on the Legend of Zelda. A playable clock. <laughs> interactive timer themed after Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link. You can play with both of them by taking control of Link. We hope you'll enjoy that kind of feels like they just decided, oh, we need some we need some watch stuff to add in here. Just, <laughs> I don't know. A timer. All right. Here's the last thing we have to show you. This is the sequel to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Hey. Okay, here it is. Two years have passed since we first announced... Right, I'll just put the schools up then, I suppose. Not that it makes any yeah. flipping difference, but... Uh... Flipping difference. Oh, got to take the layout back. Just got rid of it. We've prepared some new footage to show a bit more of the game. Please take a look. <laughs> I put enough numbers in here to go up to nine. What an idiot. Okay. Fantastic. <laughs> Let's see this. This is exciting. That's it, everyone. Thanks for watching. Whoa. Oh. Those are floating islands. Looks really nice. Almost too nice to be running on a regular Switch. <laughs> Maybe some kind of pro Switch. He's got their mad powers again. Oh my god, he went through the... He's, he can phase through solid objects now. Oh, people are going to get busy with that, for sure. Yeah, imagine. Imagine if they finished this with saying, Captured on a Nintendo Switch Pro, coming now. October. Now, it's available now. right... Look under your chairs. With a bundled launch title, Donkey Kong Country <laughs> 3. And Metroid whatever. Prime 4. <laughs> Oh man, something's going very wrong there. Oh, 2022. Next year. Next year. That's it, everyone. It's 5:39. What did you think? This time around, the setting for the adventure has been expanded to include the skies above Hyrule. Oh hell yeah, the skies. That sounds awesome. We're aiming for a 2022 release, so I hope you'll look forward to it. How was that? That's all for this Nintendo Direct. That's all for this Nintendo Direct. We are diligently continuing development on a number of other games we didn't show today. I hope you'll continue looking forward to what's in store on Nintendo Switch. Thank you for watching. Wonderful. Nintendo, everyone. That was it. Um Well <sighs> I mean it was it was a decent conference. Don't mistake our uh exasperation. Oh, no for being frustrated at the at the show it's that now we are all, we're at the end of e3 we're all tied up in our predictions contest um someone did say yeah maybe maybe dick my chinko has to come back as well yeah i saw that uh, brian bumpus and dick Machinko. um how did how does chat feel about option. that that is an option it would mean that both of us have to go there's no Ben Potter or Peter Austin for a whole month. <laughs> yeah. Except on lists. Except on lists, um, yeah. God. <laughs> I just want Bayonetta 3 or a new goddamn beautiful Joker. See you, Nintendo. Anyway, I'm just wondering what you lads would say is game slash show of the week, but I think I'm quite sure I know what Ben will say. Jack, thank you so much for the super chat. We will address that on the podcast this week. Yeah, uh, we'll yeah, talk we will. all That's about good. it. Go into full detail. Um, I'm sure we'll get lots of questions yeah. about that. So just make James lie, Jenkins be Brian. I found my big E3 surprise this year. Just pity that it was fun watching along with you all. Is that also Jack? There was that Jack cutting off Jack with a donation. Uh, that was Jack's super chat. I don't. I didn't see actually see the name on the donation, but you. I just assumed that you'd spotted it when you said Jack. No, Let maybe just... not. I swear it said Jack again for me there, but I don't think it was. The second one was Jack. That was a super chat. Uh, I'm going to look on the donation. Oh, the donation so... was Big Titty Jesus 42 Okay, I okay. see. I got them mixed up the wrong way around. I saw the one on the super chat, got confused. Right. Yes, we will answer that in uh, in due course. Big Titty Jesus 42 thank you very much for the, for the donation. And Jack, thank yeah. you for your super chat. 
both, yeah. Uh, yeah, Stephen Norrie suggests we make James Jenkins be Brian instead. <laughs> Just James um, sat editing from home, dressed up as Brian yeah. Rumpus. Okay, well, we will... I mean, leave it with us. Yeah, well, I guess we'll let you know. Um, uh, the punishment video should be out at lunchtime on Friday, hopefully. Um, yeah, so you'll find out then, basically. You, you exactly will find out. We... Anything between now and then, though, oh, will be uh, under our regular names. So I'm streaming tomorrow night on Twitch, for example. That will be Ben Potter. Mm. Uh, but come Friday, then then something will happen. Yeah, it may well be... For God's sake. Brian Bumpus and uh, Dick Machinko, potentially. Um... We'll have to have to think that you know we're we're live on the internet right now. It's difficult to just it's difficult sit to down say off the top, off the top of my head. Yeah. Gee, if only you had yeah. another presenter. Yeah, we should really hurry that up, shouldn't we? That would yeah. really just save the whole situation, wouldn't it? But mm -hmm. alas. Okay, we're gonna go now. We need to yeah. record a what happened at that'll be going out momentarily. There's a list in 20 minutes about the 10 biggest fails of E3, not just this one, but in in general. Uh, mm -hmm. We've also got another E3 list going out tomorrow, and E3 podcast on Sunday, or oh, Saturday, sorry, a full What Happened At for E3 2021, all scripted and lovely, being worked on right now by James Jenkins. So, Thank you. plenty still to come on the channel. Yeah. You're right, Peter, you moved out of frame. Oh, sorry, Where yeah. Where did you go? I just, I just had a message come through that was bugging me, it was making noises, oh, so okay. it's like, <laughs> BRB. BRB. Um, yeah, so uh, stick with the channel for all of that, and uh, yeah, you'll find out exactly what the verdict is in terms of punishment on on Friday. Yeah, um, we may even, if it comes to it, we might end up asking patrons for help, but not necessarily. So don't 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 expect a poll of anything, but also keep an eye out in case there is one, uh, depending on whether we're stuck or decided on what to do. Yeah, um, yeah, absolutely. Right. Okay, we'll catch you guys soon. Uh, take care of yourselves. Goodbye, everybody. Bye. Bye.